Hi there everybody, welcome back to Mommy Daughter Duo. My daughter is currently sleeping, so we're going to do another impromptu breakfast video where I make her breakfast. And we'll see if she gets up for it before or after I finish making it. Maybe we'll have a cute moment from a cat. So today we're going to make a French toast surprise. So I've got my frying pan, it's over about medium. And I'm going to put my egg in there. Let's see if I can adjust that a little bit better there for you. There we go. Okay, so into my egg mix, I'm going to put in some ground nutmeg. Okay, so this is actually freshly grounded nutmeg from nutmeg seeds. So we're going to put some of that in there. We're going to put a little bit of ground cloves in there. Just a little sprinkling, maybe like a half teaspoon or a quarter teaspoon or so. And then we're going to put in some ground cinnamon. Okay, so we're going to mix that all up. Dump her bread in there. I'm going to make sure that both sides are well coated. We're going to put a little bit of butter in our pan, give it a little bit of extra flavor. So we're going to put our first bun in there. And then we're going to coat the second piece. So because I'm just doing one for her, I've only used one egg. If you're making, you know, for more than one person, you might want to use two or three eggs. And depending on how much people eat, well, it depends on how much you might use. Okay, so almost the right amount, so it covered almost the whole thing. So we're going to fry both of those pieces up.
Now remember, remember everybody, we gotta be shh, we gotta be really quiet so we don't wake her up before it's ready. Corey's knowing her, she'll smell food and she'll come running anyways. I'm just going to turn it up a little bit more. So I hope everybody's having a wonderful morning. I hope this is something that you guys might think about making for yourself or for other people. It's a wonderful little breakfast to make. Something that's, you know, relatively quick. It puts a whole new spin on something that is a classic. All right, so now our two pieces of toast on the one side are all nicely brown. So you can see how it's nicely brown on that side. We're going to flip that over. And we're going to use the bottom of a cup and we're going to kind of indent into that. Okay, and then what we're going to do is we're going to take our an egg here and we're going to pour that into that little center indentation part that we made. And then we're going to throw that other piece of toast right on top of that. That egg will cook while it's inside between those two pieces of toast or two pieces of the French toast there while the two sides are cooking as well. All right, so we're going to check that bottom side there. Yeah, it's looking pretty toasty. We're going to flip that over. And we're going to continue cooking it on this side. So a little bit of our egg white has kind of leaked out a little bit, but that's okay. I mean, it's a French toast breakfast, so I mean, you're bound to get stuff like that sometimes. And that's okay. No big deal. It's just like eating an egg, and, you know. So let's see if we can show you what this looks like so far. Okay, so there we go. There's our French toast surprise so far. So now we're just waiting for that egg to finish cooking and we're waiting for the other side of the toast to finish cooking up as well. So if you'd like to see more videos like this, please leave a comment down uh, below and tell us what sort of breakfasts you like to see us cooking. Um, if you'd like to subscribe to our channel and haven't already, please feel free to hit the subscribe button so that you can see when we've uploaded a new video. And if you want to be notified, then hit the bell button. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I think we're going to be doing a lot of rhubarb recipes this week coming up for future videos. Looks like this is just about done.
that's pretty much done now. So we're just going to pull that out of the pan. It's going to seem really weird, but it's going to be really good afterwards. Maybe what's French toast with a little bit of maple syrup. going to make it pretty by putting a little bit of icing sugar on there. You don't want too much. Just a nice little dusting. Of course, you know, some of it's not going to show up once it hits the syrup, but that's okay. what this looks like now. Should we cut it open and see what it looks like on the inside? Yeah. Here it is on the inside. Doesn't that look delicious? Look at that nice runny yolk right there. Alright, and that's the rest of this breakfast. So I'm going to go get my daughter up so that she can come and eat her fetched host surprise. And we'll see you all later on the next video. Bye.